to the part eight of the Grumman two teardrop series. We just did the hatch. Now we're going to do the floor. Uh, so we'll zoom in on that some. Okay, then we'll go ahead and select it. And let's go ahead and make that a group right off the bat. We'll make it a group. And we'll double click on it, open it up. Now we're going to color this. And what we're going to do is we're going to color it, uh, uh, this this color right here. I like this color for the floor. Uh, we'll do both sides. And then we'll go ahead and extend this out and make it in 3D. So again, you click Control. You'll see the little plus come up there. Click and drag in the direction you want, 58 and a half inches. And there you go. You got your floor. Um, click on that group. We'll go ahead and name it. We'll name it... Uh, Excuse me, right here, floor, and we'll close these, and then you can see floor it goes away. Okay, so what we'll do now is we'll go ahead and zoom back, and then we'll double click on that, the profile group, edit, uh, select all, go back up, edit, copy. Click out of the group, and then paste. paste. And now what we're going to do is we're actually going to do the bulkhead and shelving in 3D. So what we'll do is we'll delete everything we don't need. Uh, delete. And this is just uh, trying to get rid of some of this stuff a little bit faster. And then we'll go ahead and start erasing the stuff that we have to. Now you want to make sure that you don't delete any of the bulkhead that you need. But you end up having a lot of little lines that you got to make sure you delete. Now we got a little line right here. Okay. Now for this solid surface here, you're going to have to delete that into by itself. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and make this a group. Uh, go up, edit, make group. And then we'll go ahead and create a layer for this group. We'll call it uh, bulkhead. And then we'll go up here and name this group that we're in. And we'll name it bulkhead. Okay, test it, see it goes away. Okay, so what we'll do is uh, select on the group, open it up, edit, Select all, and then I'll go ahead and color it. I like to use a little bit lighter color or darker color, however you want. Uh, since we got everything selected, it should all turn uh, colors. Okay, and it did. So what we'll do now is uh, we'll go ahead and start push pulling, uh, and everything's going to be. 58 and a half inches again, so you'll hit the plus sign, and you got to make sure you hit the plus sign each time, or it uh, will not leave the surface, and it'll end up looking like an empty can from the other side. So make sure you have the plus sign. Click 58 and a half. Uh, one thing you can do is you can, uh, I'll show you that. Uh, there's the plus sign there. You can drag back. Well, I can't do it. It's too far back. But you can click and drag your mouse to the back to the end and hover your mouse over this this end that's back here and it will uh, do it. But uh, anyway, we'll click 58 half inches. Um, I can't get it. 58 and a half, 58 and a half, 58 and a half, and see, and I just double clicked on it and it actually went. So uh, again, there's your bulkhead and shelving, uh, and we'll go ahead and stop it there.